<laughs> Look at here. We're still on a Ford. <laughs> yep, we got an old Ford here. This is the new project for the weekend. When I said stealing, like I said, we're stealing. The old boy lost the key to his truck here, and we're going to see if we can do it this weekend. We're going to take this truck out, pull the motor out, get his other truck, get that out there, and uh, pull this motor, put it back in. Inline six, so it's real simple to do. So, but uh, uh, yeah, we uh, had to break into it, and he couldn't find the key. And luckily, this is a non-tilt steering column otherwise it would really been a pain but all right you know how long it's been since i drove a stick <laughs> kind of crazy ah uh, make this corner here Cruising on a Ford F-150, an 85, and I could lose a wheel at any time. That's what happened to them before. They lost the wheel. So, puts her out on the gravel, staying off the main roads. And then we got a truck to tear apart. Boy, she does sound good. So, anyway, we'll probably see you at the farm. You forget what old vehicles were like, but boy, that's a function I miss nowadays is these. I know everything's got air conditioning. Excuse me. But those old vent windows, those were handy. Yep, this old truck. Don't know if it's got 155,000 or 55,000 on it. I guess it wasn't drove a lot, so it's hard to tell. Well, here's our water supply for right now. 15 pounds of air to that. Pressure washer. And he's all over here washing off the new motor. He was a greasy pig. Starting to see bolts and stuff, so. Yeah. And now I'm not putting the head this down near the power washer again. Well, we're going to add on to the uh, Ford. We tore that one apart the other day. That motor's ready to lift out. Now we're getting this one ready to go. I gotta go get my fan tool, see if that's going to break that thing loose. Yay, yay, yay. Gave this one quick a bath too. It was covered in oil, so anyway, I gotta go unlock tools and uh, see if we can get this thing switched. So, alrighty. Hey everybody, what's not happening? What's not happening is this motor ain't changing itself. We got the jack under the transmission. Motor mounts are undone, gas lines undone, all the wiring's undone, exhaust is undone, everything's undone. And we're finding out already. See that little tube there? This replacement motor don't have it. And the carburetor on this one was missing bolts. And the threads on the Ford here for the water pump was so good and tight. Um, we found out how well my Lyle tool holds up. I well, took the threads right off the end of the water pump, both of them. So we need a new water pump. But well, I gotta get stuff out of the way here because the neighbor's coming with his tractor to lift this one out, set it down, pull that one out, and put her back in. So then we can start hooking stuff back up and 
then we can go find the old boy. By that time, it'll be a good time to take a break. Let's go see if we can find the old boy that owns his truck and have him get his water pump and stuff. So, all righty. I'll find my stand and show you guys the pole. Now, that's what you call a cherry picker. Uh, sorry, we forgot to turn you guys on when we started, but... Well, just let her go and see what you guys get here. Where's that shirt go? Uh, I think... Go grab it out of the truck quick. Okay. Oh, well. Oh, this is going to be interesting. What? See, the train is already going to give us trouble a little bit. Out though, I'm going to keep the bell housing off of one of these train off that parts truck that might work for uh, starting Ford Motors. Oh, sh did one of the pins pull out of the block? Okay. That pin pulled out of this side. That pin stayed in on that side, so we might be okay. The alignment pins, yeah, whew, they're going to stick. Thank God they stuck the right way. Otherwise, we've been fighting it. I know what that's going to make it fun, getting that damn tin shield lined up now. Gotta move the alignment pins. There we go.
Marco. So close.
stop take jack down once. Oh, okay. You. Tell him to let it down real let down on the jack quick. I'll take the jack clear out. And tell him to let the motor down slow. Okay, hold, right there. I'll tell him to let it down slow. Just a little. because I think I know what's going on.
one motor mount spike if you do it from between the two trucks. That's why I hate Fords. starting her up. I gotta go get the thermostat gasket and uh, water pumping gasket. Then I'll be ready to put that on and tighten up the carburetor and get that hooked up and ready to go. So that's how close we are. Okay here goes the maiden firing hopefully. <laughs> push that button on the side then you can turn the key all the way back that's what we wanted boys and girls you know what I just realized this truck did it set a new record for here at the farm you guys are thinking new record what did it set a new record for it's Ford well the new record it set is is this is the first truck in a long time to go that short a time without a motor. Whatever time it went without the motor was when we were uh, switching them. It's the first one. Nice hot when a plan comes together. But unfortunately, it won't be done till tomorrow. We cannot get the water pump today. Luckily, we went and found the old boy when we did. Otherwise, we wouldn't have been finishing tomorrow. So now, we know this thing starts and run. We can put the hood on it. And, uh, boy, that thing sounds better than it did in the old brown truck. So, I'm really tickled with that. Anyway, yeah. Uh, since that's running, and all we got to do is water pump and antifreeze tomorrow, uh... We might bleed the brakes on this and they would come back while he's still here because tomorrow's his last day. So say bye bye, Joe. Aw, Joe, say hi to your fans. <laughs> he's got to go back to his world and his uh, fun time. Yeah. So t since I know that runs, depending on what time we get the water pump tomorrow, 
we might bleed the brakes on this get the box set on that I'm gonna do the front end uh, the tune up under the hood oh yeah I gotta I got to uh, 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 fuel line but I got that stuff so anyway I'll show you the truck when we get the hood on it